Hi, um, once again, welcome back to my channel. It's been uh, a while that I haven't uh, make a video to upload in my channel uh, due to some uh, uh, busy schedule and a lot of work to do in the workshop. So today we're gonna make a video for an FJ 2012 uh, crosser. Um, which uh, the customer just told it here in our workshop and um, the engine crunk but it didn't start or it didn't fire so um, it's torn over but it doesn't fire and uh, won't run the engine so when I check uh, this part there is a spark but there is no fuel supply go going to the injector uh, or the fuel rail so yeah we are going to so that's why the yeah we remove this one here crank it up switch it on and crank the engine there is no fuel uh, goes out on this fuel filter here so when we check the when we check the power supply um, there is no pure power supply coming from um, coming from the uh, fuel pump module so let's turn the switch ignition switch on We're going to test this. Sorry. So we're going to test this uh, connector here that goes to the fuel pump. That's the fuel pump over there. So instead, in this case here, when you're just checking the power supply and the ground, you can let you can flip the the uh, second row set and the carpet so that you can have an access to uh, this window over here to just unplug the connector for the fuel pump but if you are going to replace the fuel pump in case that the fuel pump is the problem you need to remove the whole fuel tank so yeah <clears throat> this is the this is the supply here and this is the the ground uh, that's the ground so we have 1.4 volts for the ground and we have a positive supply now the fuel pump module is located at the back of the car So the fuel pump module is located in here at the side of the fuel tank on the left hand side of the vehicle if it is right hand drive if it is left hand drive vehicle it's on the other side so this one is a right hand drive so the fuel pump module is located on this one here and there is a bracket that uh, connect to the chassis so I think there's a problem with because I just wiggle the connector here and we already got a positive supply goes to the uh, fuel pump because this module here is exposed um, when uh, when the vehicle it goes for a four wheel driving this one is exposed to uh, mad uh, water so it's always be become uh, wet so let's have a look and uh, check this connector here maybe um, when I check before when the car uh, coming in there is no power supply going to the fuel pump 
Yeah. So this model 2012 uh, FJ Crosser um, don't have a fuel pump relay which the some other model has but this one doesn't the fuel pump relay is located on this corner here if there is but if not control module already for this fuel pump so it doesn't fit in more relay so let's have a look if the engine will start So now let's start the engine if it is uh, starting or not. So yeah, so the engine starts. This means to say that our uh, fuel pump module over there is having a problem. Uh, which of which uh, we don't know yet, but we need to open the connector uh, to check if there is a corrosion on the. Um, connector pins or even on the fuel pump module pins so let's have a look <laughs> 